I am First Lieutenant Scott Leroy Sanchez with the 307th Chemical Company. We are based out of Southern California, specifically Bell Gardens, LA area. Today we are in Miskatatuck Urban Training Center conducting mass casualty decontamination. The capabilities of 307th are reconnaissance, which would go into an area, uh, find out what contaminant we're working with. We are currently conducting an exercise with a nuclear event where we are charged with decontaminating tens of thousands. I am Specialist Alia Isabel Ruiz Hernandez. I'm with the 307th Chemical Company and we're out of Bell, California. For our role, we're responsible for taking in casualties, whether they're able to walk, we'll put them in ambulatory decon, and if they're not able to walk, then we'll put them in non-ambulatory, so they get slided through a kind of like conveyor belt, and they get washed and ripped out of their clothing. We use the tech decon unit, and they provide us with the materials that we need to scan them, make sure they don't have any radiological or chemical substances still on them after the wash. Once they're clear, they're ready to head on and check with the medics to check their vital signs. And when we switch off with other soldiers, we also go through tech decon and they scan us and we wash ourselves through the lines for non-ambulatory and ambulatory. And then it just switches off back and forth. It's important for us to do these missions because sometimes soldiers only get to practice what they learn in the school where they train from. Once they get to their unit, there's a chance that they may not be able to fully incorporate everything that they learn. This mission will help us prepare in case something does happen in the real world. And if not, it at least freshens us up with what we're supposed to do. This is a genuine opportunity to actually come into contact with the American people. Every single soldier out here came up, rose their right arms to defend the Constitution against all enemies, foreign and domestic, and we all swore a creed where we serve the people of the United States. And this is that opportunity.